Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm very excited to start filming this because this has been in the works for a very, very long time. I bought these in like August and I've had this little things for like a year. So there's just a lot of things that have gone on in my planner system that I've sort of wanted to change and um, I finally changed it. So this is the Foxy Fix Personal Wide Spice Leather. Um, the uh, lady that I bought it from off of the Facebook Market Group um, didn't have the order form, so she isn't really completely sure what the name of the leather is, but I'm pretty sure that it's called Steel. And she has the silver stitching and a fox and pit bow. It looks a little bit purple, pink foil. I'm not quite sure, but it's really pretty. And then like the silver elastic type thing. So I'm very, very excited about this. I've wanted to do a flip for a very long time and I haven't yet. And it's October 1st and I did my spooky setup. So let's just get right into it. So I'm going to be Leia for Halloween and I decided to get this die cut from Banana Doodle Shop and I put it in this little pocket. I also have this little sticker that I got at like a uh, local festival. And then I have two more Banana Doodles die cuts and they're so cute. And I just have them in this little pocket. Sometimes you can't see them, but I know they're there, so yeah. Then I have all of my Halloween slash fall theme stickers. Both of these are from Banana Doodle Shop. These are from Pumpkin Paper Co. I cut this like a year ago and I tried to save it, but it's fine. And then two Once More With Love stickers. I just wanted those to be up in front so I can use them and access them easily. And then this little thing is from Hobby Lobby. Both of them are from Hobby Lobby. This is the vellum, this is the paper, and I just sort of layered it and put it in this back pocket just to give it a little bit more of a cute feel to it. So this is from Whimsical Cat Studios. I got it as like a little booklet and I cut it in half and I glued it onto this paper from Hobby Lobby. It's just the spider web, vel or not vellum, paper. And my side tabs and my top tabs are from Martha Plans. These are called like the simple scalloped tabs. I got them in silver. And I got them in silver just because I knew it would match every type of setup for the fall season. And this is a vellum from Banana Doodle Shop. This is a paper from Hobby Lobby. And my first section is school. And this is a Annie Plans printable insert collab with Once More With Love. And it's just a bunch of notebook paper. I thought it was really cute um, just for notes and things like that for school. And then this is also from Annie Plans. It's the monthly 2019-2020 for my junior year of college. And I sort of just color code each class with the assignment. I like to have monthly overviews just so I can look, it, look at it and just be prepared for the week, things like that. Then I just have this paper from Hobby Lobby and Simply Go to Washi. And then I have this little dashboard I made from uh, Simply Go to Washi Tape and a journaling card from Pumpkin, Cape, Pumpkin Paper Co. And then this insert is from Justinia Printables. It's just a week on two page horizontal. And I also like to have a weekly. I know it might seem redundant, but um, I just like to go day by day just to see what I have to do for that day. So this week is kind of busy. I'm surprised I have time to do a flip. And then this next section is my list section. So I have this journaling card from Simply Gilded and a die cut from Banana Doodle Shop and this paper is from Hobby Lobby. I just think it's so cute because it looks like the pumpkin has a bat bow. So cute. And then this first section I have in here is passwords. I covered up most of my passwords that I put in here. This is from um, Annie Plans Printables. Most of them are Annie, Pr Annie Plans Printables and just Annie Printables. So and then this next section is my inbox section. This paper is also from Hobby Lobby. And this is from Fox and Cactus with a more Simply Gilded Washi. And I just have separate pages for separate things. I got this idea from Pigtails and Pockets on her most recent flip. And she has like pages for different sections of what her 
um, what her inbox looks like. So I have happy mail on the side, important dates that I still have to sort of plan and things like that. And then I got this little paper pack. Um, it's actually like supposed to go on your fridge, but I just ripped some out and punched them and cut them a little bit to fit. And I'm really excited about it. I think I'm gonna use these for my grocery list. That way I can just take them out and it won't be like valuable inserts that I have to reprint, you know what I mean? And then this is a journaling card from Scribble Prints Co. It's like hollow foil, it's really pretty. On the spider web paper from Hobby Lobby. This is my pet insert. Um, it's also from Annie Plans. I haven't filled it out yet because I literally got this like three days ago. And then I also have a vellum from Banana Doodle Shop for my next section. This is a paper from Hobby Lobby. And this is the movie and TV tracker. So you just write the movie, date, watch, review. I also had this in my A6 or Estelle. So you probably have seen both of these inserts before if you've seen that video. And then I just have this paper from Hobby Lobby. This washi is from Michaels. And then my next section is my calendar section. So I have monthly, weekly, and daily top tabs. And so the first, I just have this film from Hobby Lobby, this paper from Hobby Lobby. And this is not technically supposed to be upside down, but I thought it was cute because if you've ever watched Stranger Things, the upside down is scary. And so I think I'm gonna try to find like a Stranger Things like sticker or die cut to put right there. But it's also cute upside down. And then I have my personal monthly. These tabs, these small tabs, are from Planner Press. And I didn't really put them on the way that I wanted them to, but they still look pretty okay, in my opinion. So let's flip October. This is October. This is the Simply Goaded Washi from her recent, like, Halloween release. And then my next section is weekly. And this is the vellum from Banana Doodles. A paper from Hobby Lobby. And for my personal weeklies, I just have a week on one page. This is from Jacinia Printables. And it's just kind of like a weekly overview. I don't really put too much information in here because most of my information is on my dailies, which is the next section. And this is a digital from See Any Draw. And I got the 5 by 7 not knowing I was going to move into personal wide, but I just um, scaled it down to 96% and I cut it and printed it on regular paper. You could do it on vellum or acetate, but I didn't have any of those, so I just did it on regular paper. And this is a Amy Plants Principal collab with Coffee Monsters Co. And it comes with a monthly. I haven't really decided what I'm gonna do with that yet, but uh, let's see. So this was yesterday, this is today. I decked it all out because it's the first day of October. And yeah, I like this insert because I put my schedule here. Let's go back to this day. I put my schedule on here and then I put my to do's right here. This column is Erin Condren width for stickers, so I'm very excited to add stickers to it. And I really like it because it has like the Coffee Monsters Co. washi, and I'm very excited to use this. It's been working really well so far. And then my next section is my fitness section. This is a another vellum from Banana Doodles and this paper from Hobby Lobby. This is from Justinia Printables. It's mainly just gonna be like my health goals, like goals by month, and I haven't filled it out yet. And then I just have this fitness log also from Justinia Printables. I just love her lettering, like it's so pretty. And this fitness log is basically just the date that you did it, what workout, the duration, and just an extra column. And it goes by month. This is probably the most basic insert that I could probably use for fitness, but I think it'll work for me just because I don't really like to meal plan. I don't really like to plan my workouts. I kind of just like go with the flow. And this will be great to see how often I'm working out and what I'm doing, things like that. And then my last section with this Hobby Lobby paper is my finance section. And it's basically just a finance log, just almost the same as the fitness log. And just date, description, withdrawal or deposit, and the balance after. And I'm very excited about this as well. I kind of go with the flow with my finances too because I get tips. I also get 
a paycheck every two weeks and I only have like two bills to pay so I don't really have to budget a lot. I kind of just do it mentally and that's pretty much it. And then I just have this page lifter. It came a little bit bent um, but it still works really well. I tried to bend it back a little bit but it's not seeming to bend it back. And then this is just my little dentist reminder card and in this back pocket I just have some um, stickers that I've gotten within the past like two weeks that I don't know what to do with but I kind of want to incorporate so that's just back there for now and that is basically everything I hope you enjoy this flip uh, I really 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 love this Halloween setup that I've done it's very like spooky but also really really cute and I love this leather this is the first time I've had spice and it is so soft and so so nice quality it does scratch a little bit but that's just the overall character of the leather and it's a little bent right here but I think that's supposed to be like that so yeah I hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and I will see you on my next video bye